Hello, my name is Jamie Nos McIntyre and welcome to my pre-visualization video. The video that I'm going to make for this semester is entitled Late, and this is the cast and crew that I'm going to be working with. I wrote the script with intentions of making a comedy as I've never dabbled with this genre before. As you can see, I've made a few different edits, fine-tuning and adding detail. However, to make sure there's not too much micromanagement with directions. As for the production design, I'm going to be using bold colours which I think goes with the character and his playfulness. And I'll also use clocks and watches to remind the audience of the character's lateness. I will now address an experiment with some major elements that I think is going to be a challenge when shooting. Firstly, cinematography. For some of the glances and look away that the character does, for example when the character first sees his dirty laundry on the floor, or when the character looks out the window to see whether it's sunny. I want to use the motion of the camera to see what the character sees rather than a cutaway shot. I've taken reference from La La Land, as you can see. The reason I've chose this stylistic choice is I think it will add to the pace of the film and also the comedy. Secondly, I want to address the editing. At the beginning of the film, we see the character receive a text. I want the text to appear on the screen, as you can see here. The reason for my decision, rather than the alternative, as you can see, the over the shoulder to read the message shot, I think it's cheap and I also don't like the fact that we can't see the actor's reaction. Also with a better camera and on a larger screen I think the fingerprints on the screen will be noticeable. Also in regard to editing, as well as the acting, the transition from the character posing in front of the mirror to him waking. My vision for this transition is to cut from one shot to another, as you can see here. I'm aware, however, that this might be hard to achieve and making it look good, so I'm open to alternatives, as you can see here. I've spoken with my team and my producer has factored into this extra shoot, allowing for us to film both on the day, and this should give us the room to decide on the editing floor which one works better. Finally, the audio. Due to the lack of dialogue, the audio is going to play a crucial role throughout the whole performance to make sure the energy is kept and making sure the audience don't get bored. There's moments throughout where foley or sound effects can be added, both for the comedic effect and also to fill the dead space. But the most crucial part for me is at the ending, when the character wakes up from his dream. My idea for this part is we hear the pinging from the microwave which fades into his alarm. I played around with this sound and this is what I think it should sound like. Thank you for watching my video and I look forward to the final product.